This is Good Morning Arkansas, an early morning look at news and weather, Arkansas people, places, and events. And now, Good Morning's Donna Axum. Well, good morning, everyone. First of all, let me point out our beautiful new set. Uh, we'll be enjoying this all during the month of February, and it is provided to us by White Furniture in Benton. Go by and say hello to those good folks and tell them how much you enjoy their beautiful furniture. This Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, some 1,200 math teachers will be converging upon Little Rock from all over America. They're here for a national convention, and today we're going to see how one Arkansas math teacher teaches elementary school students through computers. It should be fascinating, and we'll also tell you about that convention. Also in Pine Bluff, they're starting to restore the Old Pines Hotel. We'll hear a special report on that, and we'll also be telling you about the 8th Annual Arkansas Boat Sport Tackle and RV show coming up. But first, John Philpott, get us started with the latest in agricultural news. Started sleeping a little yeah. bit ago. I'll tell you what, I just drove over from North Little Rock uh, about half an hour ago, and it's just raining a little bit. It's really not sne uh, sleeting yet. The roads are not slick at all, but that doesn't mean that they won't become slick because the temperature is low and the conditions are ripe. But uh, right now, it's still all right, and we'll keep our fingers crossed. And we'll we have do have a weather. few school closings, John. Uh, a few of the schools, especially in northern Arkansas, have already called us and announced that they will not be open today. Those include Wick School. Later. See you tonight on News Scene. Donna? <coughs> That's our show for today. Tomorrow we're going to be focusing on Phi Beta Lambda, which is a national fraternity for both men and women who are in vocational technical education. Arkansas and some of its chapters have won over 30 awards nationally. We'll be telling you about that during our focus on vocational technical education. On Thursday, we'll have a state trooper with us who will uh, begin to tell us how to prepare your car for snow and ice. And then on Friday, we'll show you how to drive in snow and ice, something we all need to know here in Arkansas. Have a good day. We'll See you again tomorrow.